I like this one. What does mildly venomous mean? Uh, like mildly spicy. <laughs> You might it's exactly eat. what it means. It says yeah. exactly what it means. It's a, it's a, yeah, it's very descriptive. So you might like a little bit of Tabasco on your eggs, but you're not putting, you know, you're not doing the like one chip challenge as a snack, right? Uh, so it's very much like that. There are animals, there's a lot of snakes, including things like garter snakes, that have some toxicity to their venom, but it doesn't mean it's dangerously toxic. Um, and the reason why we use words like mildly is that we have to, we have to qualify that, right? So if we say, um, if we characterize things as just venomous versus non-venomous, you're going to end up with a list of animals like ground snakes, shovel nose snakes, garter hog -nose snakes, snakes, hog nose snakes. Um, that. Yeah, things that things that you know, like venomous because people equate venomous to danger in the hospital. When most of those things either aren't going to bite you, aren't going to hurt you if they did bite you, or it's such a non-issue uh, that it's not worth mentioning. It's more of just uh, from a human perspective, trivia answer. So. You're left with saying things like mildly venomous or dangerously venomous uh, so that you can differentiate, differentiate between those two things. Uh, hopefully the answer is kind of complicated, but we need to, yeah. A lot of snakes are venomous. Well, there's venomous lizards that, um, that aren't even Gila monsters that, that comes up too. All the monitors have some 